the original price of the product will be at 100%. And obviously, VAT for now, value added tax for now is at 15%. Now, if if, if a product at the price of a product is VAT intrusive, it means that that price is already at 115%. And I've said that before, you multiply by what you want, you divide by what you're given. In this case, we are given um, the VAT amount, we're actually given the value or the price of the product without VAT. 100% means that it doesn't have VAT in it. For me to calculate VAT, I'm simply going to take that thousand rand i'm going to multiply it by 15 divided by 100 which is the same as 15 percent and that will give me 115 115 take 150 and add it with a thousand rand it will give you 1150 that is very intrusive in my next example i'm given a value which is very intrusive since it's very intrusive you Figure out, you have to figure out what is it that you want. If I want VAT, I'm simply going to take that 2875 and multiply it by 15 and divide it by 115. 115 because I'm dividing by 115 because that 2875 in it already I've got VAT. Two thousand eight hundred and seventy-five is already at one one five. So if I want VAT, I will simply take two thousand eight hundred and seventy-five divided by one one five and multiply it by fifteen, and it'll give me VAT. In this case, obviously, I wanted my VAT exclusive value. Hence, I did the same thing, which is two thousand eight hundred and seventy-five divided by one one five percent, and I'm going to multiply that by hundred. That's why I have 2,875 multiplied by 100 divided by 115. And that will give me a value, the price of the product without VAT, exclusive of VAT, and that price will simply be 2,500. Find a difference and then it will give you your VAT amount. Your VAT amount in this case will simply be 375. Here I'm given the VAT amount, meaning that whatever I want to calculate, I'm going to divide by 15 and multiply by whatever I want to calculate. If I want to calculate the price of the product without VAT or exclusive of VAT, I'm simply going to take that 2,250 divided by 15 and multiply it by 100. If I want the price of the product inclusive of VAT, I'm going to take that 2,215 divided by 15 but multiply it by 115. Understand that. You multiply by what you want, you divide by what you're given. In this case, I wanted the price exclusive of VAT and the price exclusive of VAT will be 15,000. Obviously, you just add the two amounts to get the price inclusive of VAT and the price inclusive of VAT will be 17,250. If I have a VAT inclusive just like here, I have 18,400. Again, I'm simply going to divide by 115. So if I want the VAT amount, I will take 18,400 divided by 115 and multiply it by 15. If I want the VAT exclusive amount, I will simply take 18,400 divided by 115 and multiply it by 100.
the ones that I didn't explain, please try and do them before checking out solutions, okay?